beautiful people, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Today we are answering the question that you've probably asked yourself a thousand times before. Why should I play Tin Whistle? Now there are thousands of mental health benefits, physical benefits, social and even spiritual benefits that can be attached to playing and learning to play a musical instrument. But with Tin Whistle in particular, there are so many amazing reasons why you should get started if you don't already play. Firstly, Tin Whistles are super affordable. So you can pick one up for five or ten dollars, and as far as instruments go, that is pretty much unheard of. So playing a Tin Whistle is a cheap and affordable way to get started. It is super easy to play. You don't need any fancy embouchure. You just blow through the top of it. And there are six holes to cover and that is it. Those holes don't even need to be covered in strange combinations. You literally just go up from the bottom to the top. It is super simple. Thirdly, you don't need to read music to be able to get started. And in fact, there are so many free tutorials like my channel and a load of other channels out there that offer free tutorials that don't use music. So yeah, you don't need to spend money and time and hours and hours learning to read sheet music. You can actually just listen and pick up a tin whistle and follow along with tabs and play the songs that you love straight away. Of course, Tin Whistle also comes with an amazing history and background to it. You'll learn about different cultures and how they incorporate Tin Whistle into their music, and also how different music genres have adopted Tin Whistle to fit in and enhance the style of music that they're trying to play. So the more you play and the more you listen, the more knowledge you gain around these different cultural uses of Tin Whistle, which is really interesting and really exciting. And of course, it's fun. Being easy, being accessible and affordable and interesting, Tin Whistle itself is just fun to play. As I've said, you don't need the musical knowledge or background just to grab a Tin Whistle and be able to play the tunes you love. And that, my friends, is very, very enjoyable. Now, if that's not enough of an overview of why you guys should pick up a Tin Whistle and play today, here are some of the mental benefits of playing a Tin Whistle. Firstly, learning to play an instrument keeps your mind sharp. Having to learn through, repeat, understand things like tabs or sheet music, listening and repeating what you hear, all these things are basically acting as exercise or a workout for your brain. And this has even been shown to help delay the onset of things like Alzheimer's or any other neurological disorders that come from a lack of brain exercise. So it's really good to keep your mind sharp, to keep you on your toes and to keep learning and working through those things that you need to remember and get into your head when you're learning to play an instrument. Secondly, it increases your concentration. Obviously, if you're trying to work through something difficult, you're focused solely on that. So your concentration and your ability to remain focused on one particular thing actually improves the more you play an instrument. Thirdly, playing tin whistle, or an instrument in general, improves your memory function. So the more information that you need to retain in your brain, the more your brain gets used to retaining information. So the more you practice and the more you have to remember, the better your memory becomes. It's like doing push-ups. When you first start, you're useless. The more you do, the better you get. And the same applies with your memory. The more you exercise it and the more you use it, the better it becomes. Playing Tin Whistle is also amazing for your mental health. So this involves things like music being a stress reliever, reducing depression and anxiety. It can also help boost your confidence, especially if you learn to play a particular song or tune and then you get excited about it, maybe you share it with some friends and then you share it with a wider audience. And this can be online or it can be playing at a wedding or a birthday party. It just brings your confidence levels up and reduces the anxiety that you have generally in life because you're learning and focusing on something new. It can also teach you patience, and that is one thing we lack big time in today's world. Teaching yourself the patience to make mistakes and then practice through them and recover from the fact that you've had some sort of frustration in your practice just allows you to grow as a person and take care of your mental well-being. Playing Tin Whistle can also improve your overall mood and even help you work through emotions. So maybe if you're struggling with something and you want to find a way to express yourself, you can do that through improvisation, you can do that through adding emotion into tunes you're playing, and it can kind of act as a sort of a therapy to get you through anything that you're processing or dealing with right now. So learning to play and focusing your attention on expressing whatever feelings you're feeling right now through an instrument and through creative expression yourself can be really enlightening and mood enhancing when it comes to playing Tin Whistle. Now we've covered some of the mental benefits, but there are also some physical benefits to playing Tin Whistle as well. First, 
Firstly, physically, playing tin whistle uses a lot of breath and you learn to control that breath the more you play. So it can help improve your lung capacity if you play low whistles and you're getting used to pushing a lot of air through your body. It can also get you used to using your diaphragm correctly and really making use of the air that you take in. So that's really useful for helping keep your breathing healthy. Secondly, physically, Tin Whistle improves your reflexes and your flexibility. For example, stretching over certain notes or holding your hands in certain ways or holding a heavier weight whistle can actually improve the strength and toning and the flexibility of your fingers. So spreading hands to reach certain holes, holding your body, working those fingers in positions you haven't before really will strengthen your hands, your wrists, your fingers and even your arms. And as for reflexes, well, some tunes need to be played pretty quickly and when you first start out that will be really difficult but the more you practice that muscle memory kicks in so your reflexes generally become quicker over time and faster tunes become easier the more you play them. And finally, the third thing you might notice physically when you play Tin Whistle is that your posture improves. You might spend more time standing up or sitting tall because you're playing some sort of instrument. You'll find that you might relax your shoulders or you might find a better position for your elbows. And generally you'll have an overall better posture instead of slouching in front of the TV or looking at your phone. Now the spiritual benefits of playing Tin Whistle are a little bit different for everyone, but one of the things you might notice is that you can use music to be more mindful and more aware of your current situation and stop thinking about the things that are actually getting to you. The music you play, you create, and the music you listen to because of Tin Whistle can help you in a number of ways, especially if you're heading down spiritual or religious journeys. You can use that music to really enhance your experience of that and create a unique musical experience based around whatever you want to do with your lives. Finally, playing Tin Whistle will, I guarantee you, benefit your social circle. Whether it's joining a Facebook group for lovers of Tin Whistle, whether it's going to a local pub and listening to the session or the folk night that they've got on there, whether it's playing or collaborating with other people online, getting involved in my collaborations or playing live with somebody else in person out and about, or basically getting asked to play at events. Once you get into music and once you play an instrument, those opportunities will arise and your social circle will expand whether that's online or in real life. Now one thing I mentioned earlier on is that Tin Whistle comes with a history around the instrument and you'll get to learn a lot of things that you never knew before. I know so much about Ireland and Irish history and the Tin Whistle in general, the cultural associations that it has with it. I know and I've listened to so much more music than I'd ever heard in my life before. Since I've been playing Tin Whistle, I've listened to genres I didn't know existed and I didn't know or I didn't realise that Tin Whistle was included or involved in everything from traditional Irish, Scottish, English, Welsh music, Breton music. It's found in Quayla music in Africa. It's found in jazz music, rock music, metal, folk music, pagan and religious music. All these interesting things that you never thought was possible and you can play any genre of music on Tin Whistle. So if you've been wondering why you should play Tin Whistle or why you should restart playing Tin Whistle if you stopped, then hopefully this video has answered your questions. And don't forget for the record, if you do play Tin Whistle and you subscribe to my channel, well heck, you get to see this face every week. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this week's video. If you did, please do hit the like button down below, subscribe if you haven't, and be sure to hit the bell so you guys get notifications every time new videos come out here on YouTube. Also leave me your comments, questions, suggestions, or experiences in the messages down below. I would love to hear how Tin Whistle has affected you, made your life better, improved your mental, physical, emotional well-being, or how it's helped you get through something. Let us know in the comments down below. Everybody in this community here would love to read about your experience with Tin Whistle, so please do chat to me down below. Don't forget if you want to support the channel you will find the super thanks button just below this video which you guys can use to support this video or my channel one off. You can also support me on Coffee and Patreon, that can be one off or monthly as well where you guys get a whole bunch of extras such as mp3 covers of all the tunes I produce, backing tracks, printable pdf tabs, exclusive videos, voting rights, priority tune requests and so much more. Also if you guys would like to learn more about Tin Whistle or learn some Tin Whistle terms and basically get some general tips you guys will find some interesting videos here. I hope you enjoy those as well. 
happy whistling and I will see you again next week for hopefully some collaborations with some amazing musicians. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.